Hello, welcome to day five of the Kobe Grow Along from City Hydro. Today we can see in the tray that there's quite a bit of nice growth going on. The, the microgreens are starting to fill in a little bit. They're starting to get their leaves are starting to pop out. Still got some root hairs going on in there. The, those root hairs will be throughout the entire process. Um, we're also getting some amazing growth in the root system itself. So let me lift up this pad here and show you the amazing growth in the root system. Then you can see the roots are starting to drop down. So any of that water that might have been building up in the bottom of the tray now is being soaked up by those roots. So that water in the bottom of the tray is actually helping to coax the roots down into the bottom of the tray. So you're getting a full nice root system on the bottom of the pad. If you're not getting a nice full root system on the bottom of the pad, you could be underwatering a little bit and not enough water in the bottom of the tray. So let me go ahead and zoom back out here and I'm going to tilt this tray up and show you a little bit of the water in the bottom of the tray. Oops, slid down there a little bit. So now you can see that the, the water in the bottom of the tray is built up pretty good um, there. And all of those, all of that water is full of nice nutrients from the seeds and everything that are starting to decompose in the water. So the plant is actually soaking those up getting those nice nutrients uh, for the plant's first few days of growth. So again, it's a nice 30 second watering back and forth, back and forth, up and down, making sure you get those corners, making sure you got that fine mist going on on the nozzle, back and forth, 30 seconds. And you can see it's really, those those microgreens are really starting to look great. They're starting to see the purple color of the Kobe. And Kobe is just an amazing looking microgreen and it's a cheap microgreen to grow as well. The seeds aren't that expensive. Okay, And then you can also see that there's still water residue on the tray lid from last night. So that's great. That means there's enough moisture in the tray to keep the root systems and the plants going. I'm going to go ahead and give that another 10 second spray back and forth making sure I cover it all up and then I'm going to put the lid back on and it's back up on the rack and then I'm going to pull down and do the bamboo one that was the rack the tray using the new hydro spacers and this is the one using the bamboo same thing here lift up the lid as you can see we're getting a really nice growth in there the microgreens are looking nice and tight. All the pads are nice and full. There's no bare spots on it. Everything's filling up. Again, if we tilt the tray up, there's enough water in there that's coaxing the roots down uh, below the pads. So again, it's a quick 30 second watering. Up and down, up and down, back and forth, back and forth. Getting them a nice drink of water. Make sure you get those corners you can't miss a day of watering with microgreens. It's a seven day a week job, 365 days a year. It might only take you an hour or two to wire your entire grow operation if you have about 10 racks. So it's not a whole lot of labor and it's actually a nice relaxing labor, um, I feel wise, anyways. Okay, again, I'm gonna do the lid. Back and forth, back and forth, up and down. Getting a nice soaking in the lid. Put the lid back on and it's back up on the rack and I'll be back at it tomorrow even though tomorrow's Saturday we don't get a day off here at City Hydro happy growing and everybody have a fantastic weekend and thank you for participa participating in our City Hydro Kobe Grow Along